You said you'd be writing a book this year, next year. Yeah, actually, I wanted to write a book on governance. Thank you for mentioning that. I've been thinking about it. I've talked to a lot of people like uh, Jeremy Pitt over at, um, I think he's at Imperial. I talked to John Buck. Uh, I've talked to probably more than 50 governance experts this year. We obviously have all the experiences with Catalyst. I'm still learning and I'm still growing. And I don't think I'm at a position yet where I can write the comprehensive magnum opus on these things. But it is something I really want to do. And uh, I'm very, very excited about the things we can talk about and the nature of decentralized governance. I really enjoyed uh, reading things like um, Culture and Empire and uh, books like that, The Sociopath Code uh, from... Uh, Guy created zero MQ. His name is escaping me for the moment. It'll come to me in a minute. Uh, he uh, he was a uh, he died of cancer, but he was a brilliant guy, uh, and he really had a great finger on the pulse of how open source project governance needs to work and how people need to think. And uh, it would be really fun to get into the guts of that and talk about how we're doing it on a scale of two million people at the moment. And uh, thank you for reminding me about it. It is a thing. And the JavaScript course is another thing that I'm real excited about, uh, the programming class. And I've still been talking to a lot of different people. It's just I've been so caught up in you know, fine details like the, the Hoskins and Center at CMU and uh, you know, figuring out, getting another author for Mastering Cardano because the one we had fell through. This type of stuff. It's, it's, this is just how life works. <laughs> you start with 96 things you want to do. And you do 60 in a year, and they're all awesome, but you only did 60. And what about the other 36? 